Hello, thank you for joining us today. I'm going to do a little experiment that will show you how Nutrisphere N can protect your nitrogen by inhibiting volatilization. As you know, volatilization is a problem for many and is caused by an enzyme we can't even see. This enzyme, called urease, is produced by soil bacteria and breaks down urea into ammonia ions, causing volatilization and loss of nitrogen in the field. Nutrisphere N inhibits urease so you can maximize your fertilizer investment. To show you how Nutrisphere N works, I'm going to set up a little experiment with four flasks, each with 100 milliliters of water. I'll dissolve one gram of urea in each. Keep in mind, when the urea is dissolved in water, it's still urea. When urease enzyme comes into contact with urea, it creates two ammonia ions. This will cause the pH to rise. So, I'm going to use a color indicator so we know just how protected that nitrogen is. Now I'll add the Nutrisphere in to the container on the left. Take note of that red color. If we protected that nitrogen, it should stay consistent throughout the experiment. To simulate the conditions in the field, we're going to put in a little urease enzyme. Okay. Okay, on the container with Nutrisphere in, if we add the urease, you can see that color stays the same. That means we've protected that nitrogen from being lost in the atmosphere. On the unprotected side, that urease causes that color to turn to blue. And that means that we've lost ammonia and it's starting to gas off. These solutions will also produce a gas we will measure with ammonia test strips. By taking readings over the next 24 hours, you will see how Nutrisphere N is protecting the nitrogen in addition to other competitive products we have set up. The products I've just added are Agrotain and Enzo. We're going to do an initial test in 4 hours and then 24 hours with these ammonia test strips to see where we're at, to see how much ammonia is gassing off of each of the solutions. So we'll come back in 4 hours and do another test. Alright, we're back. It's been 4 hours now and we're going to go ahead and do our ammonia volatilization measurements. We're going to do this with an ammonia strip and what we'll do is dip this in water and then place it in each of the flasks. And it's gonna tell us how much free ammonia is above each of the solutions. So this is our Nutrisphere N flask. And as you can see, has not changed color. So when we put it in our check, it changes color almost instantly. Very dark. So that is a great indication that we have a lot of ammonia above that solution and it's not inhibiting that enzyme at all. So for our competitive products, we'll have our Enzone, which also you can see has a high reading, and then Agrotain. It did not change color. So, and just to do one more for our Nutrisphere in container, And see that no urea volatilization or ammonia volatilization whatsoever. All right, we're back. It's been 24 hours now. As you can see, our Nutrisphere N solution is still the same color, which means we've protected that nitrogen overnight. And we're going to go ahead and use our ammonia test strips and do another volatilization test on the air right above the solution. So for the Nutrisphere N solution, still don't have any volatilization. Then for our check, it changed color almost instantly and that's pretty much the high end of our ammonia test strips. They don't get much darker than that. So for our competitive products we have end zone. We'll do the same test with a new strip and that also changed color really quickly. Put that there. And then for Agrotain,
it did not change color. And then just to follow up for another with another strip. Our NutriSphere end container has no volatilization. And that's after 24 hours. So we've stabilized that nitrogen and kept it in the urea form by inhibiting the urease enzyme. As the experiment has shown, NutriSphere in can be a great addition to your fertility program by inhibiting urease and keeping more nitrogen available for your crop. If you would like more information, regional yield data, or testimonials from farmers already using NutriSphere end in our other products, please visit our website or give us a call. Thank you for watching the Warner Report and see you next time.